It's Fresh Mornings with Monica and Jesse. And for the last few days, you haven't been hearing Jesse's voice on the morning show. And you're probably thinking to yourself, wait a second. Didn't he just start? Where did he go? Actually, Jesse has been in Ottawa working on a movie. So joining me on the Fresh Morning Show this morning is the one, the only, Mr. Hollywood. <laughs> are you too are you too cool for school now? <laughs> oh, please. You know you're going to have to call me that forever now, though. No. I love that. It's a one-time deal <laughs> while you're gone, and when you're back, you're good old Jesse. <laughs> I can't wait to come back. We miss you. Tell us, what's it been like filming this movie for the last few days? Oh, man, it's a lot of work. I've never realized how many hours it takes to film like a serious movie, and for us, our schedule is very early, so it's been like a total flip for me because we start at like 11 or noon and go until 11 or midnight. So it's been an adjustment, uh, but it's so much fun. I can't tell you how much fun I'm having. And you would love it too, because I've died twice. Oh, I don't know if I'm supposed to say that. (laughs) Well, no, we don't want anything to happen to you, but obviously you've come back to life both times. Yeah, let me rephrase that. (laughs) Not that you want me to die, Monica, but it's exciting (laughs) to see the movie magic happen and the special effects. Like, you could just imagine, I'm like a kid in a candy store. Every time they come and touch up the blood, I'm like, oh, you know, (laughs) can you add a contour while you're here? (laughs) So you have been doing acting for a while. Have you learned anything new while you're on set? Oh, yeah. Well, my background is in theater. That's what I studied. And so the difference there is on stage, everything's big. You have to be louder so they can hear you in the back. And with this, you barely have to speak. Like a couple of the actors on this are from L.A. They're girls. I don't know if I'm allowed to say who they are, but they're kind of a big deal in the teen world. And they barely speak on camera. Sometimes I can't even hear them across the room. And the director's like, great, that was the best one. And I'm like, did she even say anything? And so that's the difference. You can barely, you can whisper and get away with it in a movie, whereas on stage you have to be so loud. Uh, so you're blaming your theater background for you being loud? Hmm. Interesting. Yeah, that's why I'm too hyper. I'm too much <laughs> because of my theater training. <laughs> have you had a bit of a starstruck moment working with some of the other actors and actresses on the set? No, because I'm too old. And so I, <laughs> you know, <laughs> it took me a minute to realize that they were kind of a big deal. Don't tell them I said that. But... Uh, <laughs> No, everyone's been really cool, and it's just such a fun movie. Here's the thing, and I'll give this away, is I play sort of like a fitness instructor, which is great for my ego, but then I get here and I realize, now i got to look and act like a fitness instructor. And so during some of these scenes where we're teaching classes, I'm like sweating out of breath, thinking, great. And he's like, now we got to do it 10 more times. So my buns are on fire. I can barely stand up. <laughs> <laughs> doing push-ups in between takes. That's right. <laughs> Another thing I learned, because I gave you wrong information, I've been bragging that this is on Disney+, Plus, and one of the things I learned about how movies work is when a big movie produces, or a big network produces a movie like this, they shop it around to different streaming services and different TV networks, and then they all bid on it. So Disney+, Plus is one of the ones that's interested in airing this movie, but it's not 100% official yet, because there's other networks that are interested too. So we won't know for a couple months exactly where it's going to be, but it's going to be out there streaming somewhere. And You know, I'll, I'll be posting it from the rooftop. Oh, well, I know you will be, but thanks for, you know, making me give the wrong information, buddy. <laughs> I know, it's my fault. That's why, that's why I wanted to own it on air. <laughs> All right, fine. I forgive you. <laughs> I might let you back into the studio on Tuesday Please. morning. <laughs> Please. I'm excited for my morning lifestyle again. These late nights are too much. (laughs) Well, Jesse, we do miss you. And I know you still have a couple more days of shooting, but honestly, I hope you're having the time of your life right now. I am. Thanks so much, Monica. And I can't wait to see you next week.